Hi everyone, welcome to Straight from Divine Tarot. For Sunday, January 22nd, 2023, I'm here to do a collective read for you guys. Sorry, I did not upload yesterday. The AM spirit told me not to. I did do some readings, but um, as it turned out, it, it they, they, they were all for me. <laughs> uh, there were certain things that they wanted me to know. So, that was weird. So, I'm going to have to... I worked hard yesterday, too. Anyways, it is what it is. I apologize. I didn't upload, but... It was a me day yesterday, I suppose. I don't, sometimes I, I, I'm not that um, obedient. They tell me to take, they, they did tell me to take the day off yesterday morning to, to hold back any readings, and I didn't listen. So that's my, that's what I get, right? For not listening. So you know, this is a timeless read, okay? I don't use signs, I don't use genders because it's all energy anyway. So if this is your story, you'll know through the character descriptions as well as the storyline. So take what applies, toss the rest, don't try to make it fit. We're only here as readers to help enlighten you. Um, we can't tell you what to do. You have the answers within you, okay? We're here to help you bring those answers out. And that was one, 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 um, when I looked out when I said that. So we're here to give you the uh, help you find those answers within you. Sorry, pardon me. So uh, I will be using the he and she pronoun just to keep it straight in my head. No other reason because these reads do get complicated. They do get confusing. I mean, it could be any gender, it could be any sign, okay? Just bear that in mind. Get off that sign thing, because that sometimes gets in the way, okay? And, and you miss your message or you're, you're misinformed. Uh, so I streamlined it. I'll bring out the tarot cards, give you the description of the card as it comes out, as well as what I'm picking up intuitively. You know your story best. It could be all the descriptions, some or one, and then we bring it together at the end. Please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know when I upload, because it's obvious I don't upload on a regular basis or a reg regular time. Just when spirit tells me to. So uh, let's go. Yeah, thank you for being here, by the way. I love you guys. I really do. I missed you. I really wanted to connect with you. That's why I was posting memes and stuff. But um, yeah, just for readings, they told me to hold back. And I should have listened. I expended that energy. For, well, I guess there are certain things I needed to know. So let's start the read. How are we beginning to read, spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light? What is the message here today for the collective? Okay. The Web Weaver, Synchronicity, Divine Intelligence, Cause and Effect. Same, there, there you go. I didn't listen to him yesterday. Yep, there you go. Cause and Effect. So if you don't listen, you don't do what's... There's always an, a bad... Like if you don't listen, if you don't listen to your intuition, uh, there's, you, know, you get what you get, right? Synchronicity. You might be seeing some numbers. I I know I am. Every time I look at the clock, every time it's there's... Yeah, synchronistic numbers. Divine, it's, it's really ramping up for me, by the way. Divine intelligence. Yes, maybe if you questioned whether there is a God, a higher intelligence out there, whether it's true or not, maybe you're going to find that answer out in your heart. You know what I mean? A lot of us have grown up maybe under some sort of uh, organized religion or maybe none. Maybe, you know, no religion. And we didn't really give it give it any thought. And it's like, it, whatever it did come into your head, you probably thought, well, you know what, I'll deal with it later, you know, because there's no real way of finding out. I think you're going to get your answers. Camel Boy, bottom of the deck, small steps, asking for help, 33, master number. Um, every time I see it, I think of the 33rd degree or uh, Masons. You might be dealing with one or you might be one. Don't be afraid to ask for help. Small steps, is it? If you don't know how to start, take a small step. Start small. You are the rising phoenix, phoenix after all. Resurrection, surrender to change, 29. Justice, that's 11 in, in tarot. Justice is here. 33 adds up to a 6. The lovers in tarot. So there's a choice, a decision. Using your higher wisdom could be a spiritual connection and or a, a choice of two in a connection. Okay? Or it could be a contract, an agreement of some sort. Okay, but that also adds for four, the web weaver. So this is an emperor, maybe male or female, doesn't matter. Uh, somebody that's wise and uh, experienced and um, has clout and uh, stability already. Could be a father or boss, could be a female. Like I said, it just means that you're taking back your power. You, uh, you bossed up, um, you have clout and, and connections. You're wise, you're experienced, you're mature. Typically, it's not a young, young person. It can be, though. Old soul, you know what I mean? But it, somebody's weaving a web. Either it's beautiful, you're co-creating with the divine, and or somebody made, uh, they, they entrapped themselves in their own web of deceit. Let's see, masquerade, 15. That's the devil, karmic, toxic, codependent. Somebody wearing a mask, right? Maybe they're doppelganger here. 
Also adds up to a six. There was a choice of two. Maybe you had two people in mind that you cared about and you chose the wrong one. You chose the karmic as opposed to a true connection. Bottom of the deck. Blinded to pain. Wow, 13. A death. There's a change. 13 is death, right? It's a change. A death and rebirth. That's the phoenix we saw. Uh, adds up to a four again. The emperor. So maybe the emperor's taking back their power. Rising up again. You know what I mean? Somebody could be into self-harm. I hate to say it, but the picture gives that impression. Maybe because they were blinded by something. Either spell work, lust, lies. They didn't see that they were walking into a trap and they would wind up hurting themselves or others. Didn't see that maybe somebody was um, not alive inside of, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, temple of my body. That kind of looks like somebody that's taken over by the dark side, you know? Take it as supplies. It doesn't have to be that way, okay? You know your story best. Web Weaver, 4, Masquerade, 15. Why is this here, please? Ascending. Transcending obstacles. Congratulations. Learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for union. Wow. So somebody was wearing a mask. You're overcoming these obstacles. It's beautiful. Bottom of the deck, girl with a snake, empath and narcissist paradigm. Being um, charmed or used. So somebody was charmed by sex. I'm telling you, somebody wearing a fake mask. Our fake mask obviously is fake. Uh, charmed and used. They've been used for their money or endure their clout. Enable and boundaries. Maybe you're blaming yourself that you enabled it. Oh, we do play a part in these scenarios, right? You're not 100% guilt-free. I mean, I was taken in and I took my responsibility for that, you know? But it's a learning curve, right? It's nothing about, it's not about blame. Separation. Sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yearning, unsure future. So maybe they're realizing who they're, their twin is maybe or their soulmate if you if you're not on the you, know, you don't want to do that twin flame journey it's a soulmate or their true love maybe they're realizing what they've done here somebody a narcissist will bring you in okay they'll say anything do anything to get you okay because if you're an empath you take on their it, you're going why didn't i see it Be, because you're a good person inside you you're a people pleaser possibly you want to 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 be happy you want to believe what they're saying to you in my case the alarm, the alarm bell, the alarm bells were going off like crazy. Okay, because I am intuitive, and I'm going, what the hell's going on here? This is not making sense. But this person was so good at what they did. They surrounded themselves with all these different people, and there were a lot vouching for this person. So I thought maybe my my intuition was off. I must be going crazy. It must be me. Something's wrong with me. I was right. It was a ring of people that were that were low lives. Okay. So maybe that was your story as well. Maybe that's why I felt the need to say it. But it's not about blaming. It's about taking ownership, right? So we don't repeat those uh, those same patterns again. Now, I'm certainly not, but I don't blame myself. I took ownership. I knew what I did. I should have listened to my intuition. But, you know, when people are telling you you're wrong all the time, you know, you start doubting yourself. And it was a clear indication to me to never doubt my intuition. So it was a, a valuable lesson. It was a hard one, a painful one, but it was a very good lesson to learn for me for my future. So where are we going with this? Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. We have web leader, card number four, masquerade, card number 15, and ascending. I get the impression that this false person thought they would rise up in life in stature and in, in, in finances, and that's why they glommed on to you. Thank you, Spirit. There's clarity and truth here. Healthy, happy, happy, healthy, wealthy, and wise. Could be a paternity suit as well. Oh, by the way, I am using the Tarot of Oppositions. People have asked me over and over what the deck is. It's this deck, okay? This is what the box looks like. Okay, just so you know, a lot of people do ask me these things, and... Um, yeah, I get curious about people's decks, too. Seven of Swords, overarching energy. Damn. Somebody was lying, cheating, and or stealing. Seven of Swords in the upright. They're very shady. If that's not the case, and somebody is the one that got away. Wow. You're the one that got away. There was no emo Yeah. Bottom of the deck, Eight of Cups in the upright. Somebody walked away. There was no emotional fulfillment or happiness here. Eight of Cups in the upright. 
So we dropped the key. See that key? Like, fuck this shit, I'm out of <laughs> Sorry. But, yeah, somebody uh, listen to their intuition. See, typically it's, it's usually a, a moon here in most decks. And this is, they're going towards their happy, happy. They're going towards their nine of cups, emotional fulfillment and happiness, right? Facing the unknown, facing hardships possibly. The, uh, the mountains are there indicating, yeah, there's no love here. See, that person poured that cup out. Knight of Cups in reverse. It was all a scam. Somebody was very insincere. They smile in your face and lie through their teeth, never fulfilling their promises, no break, uh, no follow through. They could be, like it, like the card said, a narcissist. They love bombing until they get what they want and then they're out, right? Could be some spell work too. Yeah, they're very superficial. This person's emotionally unavailable. King of Cups in the upright. Could be a big drinker. Maybe they're going to stop drinking. Okay, there's three cups in a row, three cards of cups in a row. Yeah, they could be sick here. Um, but this is something that's emotionally unavailable. They could be in their fields drinking right now. I don't know. Could be. Take it as applies. And or they're very uh, vicious, malicious, uh, ruthless. Maybe they're finding out they're not the father. It was just a scam to scam them. Because we did see that earlier, right? The sun and the upright. We'll see which way it goes. Somebody's taking, a, yeah, somebody's sick. They're scared. They're alone. They could be injured. It could be the end of situation, a person or an enterprise. They could have some mental uh, health issues as well. I mean, narcissists, that's what it is, right? Mental health. They're getting sick over this, right? Maybe some spell work. Magician in reverse. There were, if it's not spell work, there were illusions here. A lot of deceptions, a lot of manipulation. Somebody was playing games. See the d d dice in the, the person's hand? Games of chance. Um, they were very two-faced, chaotic. This could become corruption as well. Wow. Using other people's money, using people, their emotions, their, their energy, uh, twisting logic. You see how that knife is twisted? Corrupt. This is not a win, whatever this is. Strength. Somebody's scared. They were overpowered. They were intimidated. Somebody's either trying to get somebody to talk and or just shut up. Somebody needs to humble themselves. Somebody's forceful here. They lost control of the situation. They had no integ integrity, loyalty, or honesty. I get the impression they're starving here. They're losing money. They're losing their home. See that castle in the background? Typically, castles in the background indicate abundance is here, but there's no fertile land here. There's not, not, there's no, it's all dead. The house is falling apart. The family's falling apart. They're hungry. Somebody's asking for answers. They're not getting it, possibly. Maybe it's one of those poverty curses. I don't know. But, yeah. Lost control of the situation. Somebody had a huge ego, right? They're very forceful. Very arrogant. Thought they can get away with whatever this is. It's, it looks very bleak. You know, they could be scared. Using force and intimidation. This has been going on for a long time. Somebody has to take ownership. Knight of Pentacles in the upright. They're scared. They're scared. They have to come correct. They have to make a payment on something. They want to come towards you possibly. Make an offer. Or maybe they did. They thought they went towards another person. Like I said in the beginning, there's a choice of two. They thought this was wish fulfillment. They have all their wishes granted, right? Long-term uh, long relationship here. Somebody um, acting like they have integrity, loyalty, and honesty, and that they're a healer possibly. Um, that they pour back into the world what they take out. Their wish fulfillment. Ten of swords in the reverse, ending a situation here. Uh, it could be a near-death experience. They're, uh, they're healing from this. They need money. It's going to take a long time to heal from this. That's what it is. Ending a situation here. It could be a near-death experience. Somebody's frozen now. It could be a freezer spell, too. Their wish fulfillment is to freeze somebody out of a situation. Wow. Yeah, somebody's talking here. Eight of, eight of Wands and upright taking action. Good news. They're trying to stop some good news from coming to you, some communication. It fell on the floor. So I can't make this up. It's meant to come out. This is fast action, fast communication, and or travel. Okay? This typically is good news. It could be the rods of love as well. Ooh, there's been lies. They're trying to stop the communication from coming to you. But I don't, yeah. There's been lies. There's no communication. They have a hurdle to jump over here. Lies. No clarity. 
there were illusions here. Seven of Cups in reverse. Everything that... What, you know, not all that glitters is gold, right? They're running out of options. They're losing money, possibly. They're not telling the truth. What would you do with the money? That's what I just heard. Um, they're having no choice here. Seven of Cups in reverse. The cups are empty here, right? They were promised. This is somebody that was deluded in the, in the beginning because the, the cups, you know, multiple options. Maybe they have to get rid of their options if they have, like, you know, supply. It's obvious that maybe somebody's child is not their own or children. This is um, trauma bonding. This is trauma, period. Uh, unrequited love. Six of Cups in the reverse. There's regrets here. Somebody gay did something with the misinformed, mis misinformation. Somebody's not a healer. Somebody has addictions. They could be mentally unsound, very unstable. Could be sick. It's temperance in reverse. They didn't, uh, maybe they did drugs and alcohol or whatever. Some sort of addiction, because this is a, uh, an addiction card. Um, they did too much here, okay? They went to extremes. Uh, inappropriate behavior. They, they, tra they traded gold in for gold plated. There's no balance. There's no harmony, no contentment here. No healing, no reconciliation. They could have lost some children. Maybe if they were doing, um, has some addictions, maybe, you know, wherever you live, they, they came and took the kids away. Maybe they're facing the truth. Maybe they lied to themselves in the, in the past. Uh, they had addictions. Maybe they didn't see what their actions brought forth. And now they're sick. They're, they're, you know, they're going to have to, maybe they're had maybe they're dope sick. Maybe they are. Yeah. It's the four pentacles in the upright. They were holding back. They were greedy and selfish, trying to, um, or sorry, page of pentacles. Somebody's um, doing some homework here. Page of pentacles in the upright. Um, somebody wants a new beginning. They have to make a payment here, but they're they're blocking blocking a payment. They're they're receiving. They're waiting for a payment. They need money. Ah, they need money. If they have addictions here and or they can't pay for child support or they're no longer paying for child support causing a lot of disharmony the wells w run dr dry here you know in the upright the temperance angel this is not something that's balanced or healed uh they pour healing waters into a situation or into the world right to heal there's nothing but dust here nothing so they're running out of um they're running out of money they're running out of i don't know what it is alcohol drugs whatever this is Somebody's ill. They're not in the right mind. They're unstable. So somebody has no choice but to do something about it, I think. Right? There's been a lot of denial here. self uh, you know, self-lying, I think. Not just to other people, but to themselves. Temperance in reverse. Nothing in moderation here. This is an emperor making a decision. Could be a judge. Somebody that oversees. Could be a father. Who knows? Emperor is taking back their power, bossing up. Okay? They have the authority. They have what it takes to do something. They have maybe some connections here. Oh. Queen of Wands in reverse. Somebody's angry, possibly. Jealous. Could be spell work. Could be... Very promiscuous here. This is somebody that's very um, forceful. Violent, possibly. Maybe this is somebody they're dealing with, their partner, that they chose over you, and this person's promiscuous, forceful, jealous, very abusive, um, unstable for sure, codependent. They're not independent at all. They re yeah. There's a, they brought other people into it. It could be a contract, but I think they brought other people into the relationship. Lovers in the upright. There's a choice here. Somebody's making a decision big time. They're, they're now using their higher wisdom. Oh, no. That flipped over a few times. Put it back in. Sorry. Why is the emperor in here? Ooh. Okay. Home wrecker, maybe. Ten of cups. In the, in the reverse, um, there's no emotional fulfillment or happiness here. Somebody could have been scapegoated, the breakup of a family or a group. Again, it, like I said, the 33 degree, maybe it's a... 
it's a secret society or something like that. Somebody's brought this into their society and it's like the head of the society and or a father and or a boss are going, no, 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 not under my watch. Yeah, it's bringing us down, bringing our re reputation down. Four of Wands in reverse. This person could be homeless, losing the home. Maybe it's a, a judge in court saying, bye. You're losing this relationship. They lost their twin. They're unstable, okay? Four of Wands in reverse. They could have accused you of being unstable and it was really this person. Yeah, somebody's letting go. They're giving up. Nine of Wands. This is a challenge. Somebody's angry here. Nine of Wands in the reverse. Um, they've been stopped. They can't go any further. Chariot in the reverse. This is out of control. Somebody had lacked a awareness, structure, discipline, and direction. This is um, no conflict resolution. This is uh, no awareness whatsoever. Um... It's a rude awakening. It could be a car accident. They're being let go because of, uh, they, they lost a car, maybe. They're letting go of a car. There's an investigation. Some truths have come out. Hermit in reverse. Or if they say that they're healed and they're a healer, they're not of the light. They don't carry the light. They're not awakened. They, they didn't do any soul work. But this is some truths are coming out here. So somebody's stopped here. Chariot in reverse. They can't go any further. It's not going anywhere. Yeah, this relationship's... If it's marriage or a relationship, a contract, lovers in the upright. there. No matter if it's in the upright or in the reverse, there are consequences here. A snake got in between. And that's what the person's realizing. It is, you know, they're realizing who their true, true twin is if, or past life soulmate. Um, they brought other people into this relationship. They want to reconcile with this person or it's a third party. Or they're realizing this third, this third party they wound up with it has a third party. Okay, or there could be some friends interfering here. Okay, it could be con uh, a coven. Some shoes are coming out though, moon in reverse. Wow. Could be uh, facing some fears here. Some shoes are coming out. Somebody was juggling two of pentacles in the upright. They're wearing their options here, making a head of a heart decision, needing to balance something out, or somebody's in alignment for something. Why is the three of cups here and the moon in reverse? Where is this going, please? 2230 when I said that. Yeah, somebody's standing their ground. There could be a fight here. Or somebody has to defend themselves against others. Or somebody, the truth is, is somebody's um, spiritually protected. They stood their ground. They're very defensive, possibly, at this moment. Yeah, somebody's, in, yeah, they're protecting you or defending you. You're, you're innocent here. They want a new beginning. And they have to fight their way through this to have a new beginning. Take it as applies. Uh, it's a fool in the upright. They're leaving. There's a fight and somebody's leaving. They're, they're starting over here. Spirit's backing them up. You see that dove? And they're leaving with nothing, hardly anything on, uh, with them. Just a small satchel here. It could be um, they want to stand in your way of a new beginning too. Or they're trying to stand in the way of this person, the emperor, leaving. Yeah, it's over. It's over. Whew. Maybe you have a new venture here. They see your fire. They see your passion. They see you standing strong. The truth is... You are that person. Something's coming to an end here, the world in the upright. Ending previous cycles in order to, to open up new ones. This is victory and success. You could be moving, you could be traveling. This is also travel, like going off on a new adventure, right? Yet you're letting it all go. Eight of Swords in the upright. They're not renting space in your head anymore. They're, you're removing obstacles. Maybe you were immensely conflicted at the time. You didn't know there was a stalemate. You were blocked. You didn't know what to do. Didn't know what you wanted. But there's a blindfold here. So this person is listening to their intuition finally. And that's the sword of truth. Usually there's two swords here, but no. It's, it's, they were avoiding the truth. The truth was right there in their face, staring them in the face. And they avoided it. But now they can't avoid it any longer whatever this is eight of swords in the upright seeing through the illusions breaking free devil in reverse so if they had an addiction that was holding them down they're breaking free from it if it's a person a situation they're breaking free of these illusions they are now possibly really ad admiring somebody now see how she, this person's gazing adoringly at somebody maybe somebody wanted to be on a pedestal you must adore me or maybe that you know they did some spell work in the past where it was illusions you know glamour spells lust spells love spells yeah somebody's seeing this here from a distance possibly they're moving forward leaving something or someone behind okay they're seeing you from a different angle now they're seeing you differently they're seeing you moving moving forward right 
you have security, stability. Um, you're protected for pentacles. You're letting go. Letting go, and, you know, opening up. Maybe somebody's opening up. Letting go of, you know, the the jealousies, the lies, the per, per, promiscuous person. I don't know. Four of Pentacles in reverse. Letting go. Or this is having pride in oneself, accruing uh, the stability you require. That's the Four of Pentacles in the upright. You know? You're seeing that you're you're building a foundation. Fours are foundations. They're seeing you moving ahead, building a foundation. Somebody's admiring you. Five of Cups, yeah. You broke up with this person, but you know what? You're putting your past hurts behind you. You're healing from this. You're healing emotionally. You're seeing, or maybe you're showing them how to do it. Five of Cups. They want to work with you. Three of Pentacles. There was a third party situation possibly in the past. A, a contract. They were collaborating. Maybe somebody's collaborated. They want to collaborate with you. They want to work with you. They see how you're working here. You are a master of your craft. It's a craftsman. Again, it's a ma I'm thinking masonry here. They're parting ways with this, this society. There's truth and clarity here. There could be a third party, a contract or some sort. There's truth and uh, there's healing here. It could be paternity. Hmm. They need help with children. Help with healing. Yeah, somebody was unfaithful. If it's not, if it's children, they're parting ways. There was a third party, uh, possibly paternity. If there's no children, then they know. Okay, somebody was dealing with other people. Somebody was very jealous. Very uh, greedy and, and, and selfish and codependent and clingy. Lazy. Didn't want to do anything for themselves. They had other people do it. Um, they don't know their value or their worth. They're unstable. They had no integrity, loyalty, and honesty, right? Not wifey material, that's for sure. They collaborated with a dark high priestess. They collaborated, They, you know, or maybe this person's going to turn their backs on this person because they, they talk shit about somebody. They got some wise, unwise counsel here. Uh, they're dealing with a dark high priestess. Oh, yeah, sabotaging, um, targeting people here. Lies, rumor, gossip, and slander. This is cruelty. Okay, this is pettiness. Very, uh, this was <sighs> corruption, possibly. Greed, jealousy, laziness, like I said. Abuse of power and abuse of authority. So, somebody's moving ahead. They were collaborating with a dark high priestess. Unwise counsel, talking shit. Doing magic here to target people, okay? To target people. Lies, rumor, gossip, and slander. I'm, I'm getting and picking up cyberbullying, um, gang stalking, um, a lot of lies and illusions, uh, pettiness and cruelty. Somebody's cutting this shit out. Yeah, this was corruption, abuse of power, and abuse of authority. Somebody's unstable here lazy it's all based on jealousy if you ask me oh boy yeah look at the empress in reverse again this never ends yeah doing stuff in the dark they're being exposed okay this could be a mother figure doesn't have to be but it's all empress in reverse is certainly not an empress okay if it's a, a, the, the second party that got involved and tried to pass themselves off as a a true uh divine they're not it was all greed it was corruption whatever this person is they're chaotic they could be a bad mother it could be a male in this energy okay very chaotic energy self-absorbed controlling domineering it's a bird of prey they prey on other people okay i get the feeling because she's got that mirror in her hand so it's kind of like selfies and stuff they can't look at themselves number one okay they pick prey on people that have low self-esteem <clears throat> um they don't bring new life into the world you see it's very barren there could be a stepmother too i don't know take it as a place but it's very barren there it doesn't have to be um, they, they, they destroy life. And you see that bird of prey. They prey on people. They wreak havoc. They're being exposed here. Six of Wands in reverse for what they do in the dark. Narcissist. Can't make this up. King of Swords in the reverse. Pathological liar. They're cruel. They're abusive. They use and abuse people. They could have wanted this for you, okay? But something's come to an end. It's a death. Uh, it's a birth 
Baptism by Fire, the white rose on the on the flag there. Archangel, Archangel Azrael is coming to claim something, I think. There's a change here. See, the, the castle there, there's abundance nearby. Their abundance is gone, okay? They could have a money curse on us on them, okay? You need to cleanse cleanse your home, okay? Because um, baptism by fire is a cleansing, a purification. Cleanse your area, cleanse your home, cleanse, yeah. yeah they could be getting arrested or letting go and letting God. There's illumination here, hangman in the reverse. Uh, they're acting like a martyr. Finding something out. There's an investigation. Hermit, you've gone within doing the the soul work possibly. Somebody's holding a, a light over this. Look here, here's the snakes. Somebody is has wise counsel here. They're very wise, um, connected with source here. There's a star there, you know. Like, could be a star seed. There were lies here. Somebody was a player. They were playing games. Lies, rumor, gossip, and slander. A lot of drama for nothing behind this Queen Cups is back. This is like a divine feminine energy. She put a lid on that on, on unconditional love because love begins at home. Charity begins at home. So she stopped. She stopped giving so much of herself. I say she. It could be he, okay? Maybe the, this person doesn't drink. Maybe that's why this person doesn't want to be with this person. I don't know. Take it as applies. And somebody's highly intuitive and psychic as well. Yeah, they wanted to steal their money, their gifts. Wow person was chaotic whatever this is right there's holding a lamp over this somebody's using their higher wisdom and it, their their inner knowledge here somebody's very wise it's over here it's over here yep this is financial ruin possibly it could be in spiritual jail or they want to come back in from out of the cold somebody's found their confidence here oh this is a nightmare the worst has happened nine of swords they are at lack they're sick mentally ill okay this is also pentacles is a body as well it's not just money it's not something tangible you can touch but they're mental mentally ill this is nine of swords in reverse yeah or they could have called you mentally ill but you mastered yourself you're a master of your craft <laughs> this person if they had any any um intuition any any gifts or anything that is gone i think if they did magic on you they've lost their minds they were while they were working on you but they can't get into see that cup is emotions it's soul it's energy they can't get into your energy wow they broke your heart though three of swords in the upright but you see that swords in the upright you knew the truth anyways you are the truth they wanted to steal your gifts your money your opportunities they didn't invest in you maybe they're realizing that yeah you're a master of your craft they're heartbroken they missed an opportunity. They're out of money. Um, they lost their gifts. They didn't invest well. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. This is the card of you get what you give. Right? End of the road. They can't go any further. Wow. Lost their gifts. Lost their... Yeah. Ace of Wands in reverse. No growth. Stopped. Dead stop. Not going anywhere. Because of their lies. Their pettiness. Their cruelty. Playing games here. This is bad news for somebody. Yeah. Page of Cups in reverse. Could have lost a child. And they made up lies about something. Someone losing a child. I heard sacrifice. Wow. Maybe it's not lies. I don't know. Take it up. Two children, maybe. Somebody's having an emotional outburst. They're very emotionally manip manipulative here, okay? They're insincere and um, immature. They could have been contributing to minors as well. They were playing games here. They were holding back. They were greedy and selfish, right? Playing another page. Wow. Somebody's gathering information. Poor judgment. Lack of awareness. Lack of acceptance. Lack of accountability. They're getting some harsh karma here. They don't see this coming. Justice is right on their heels. They did something with children, okay? Yeah. They're gathering information. Somebody's, something's up in the air here, okay? They're weighing the pros and cons. I just heard crown. Could be a crown attorney. Crown, here in Canada, it's a crown. I guess in the States, it's a DA or whatever you call it. They're making a decision here based on some information. This is not good. 
people don't see this coming. They don't know what to do with this. The truth was staring them right in the face all along. Maybe they just needed the proof. Here's the justice. Truth is here. Balancing the scales. This is karma again. Wow, it's a group of people. Five of Wands. Wow. See that? Magic. Queen of Wands in reverse. Sex could be having something to do with a ring, if you know what I'm saying. Force. Police raid. Knight, Knight of Swords in the upright. This is the truth. It's happening quickly. I've got chills. This was corruption. It was all for money and greed. Oh, boy. A family. Family discord. Something's going on here. Yeah. Somebody lied. They were vindictive and vile and very vile, if you ask me. And mothers. This could be a mother. Something that just, just doesn't care. Jealousy. All they wanted was the money. They, all they want, they got all these lies. Getting this is like bribery. I don't know. I'm gonna leave it there. I get chills. A web weaver. So it's all coming together. The webs are coming. This web that the, I think there's branches involved. Different people, different organizations, different. Take it as it applies, okay? The web weaver, synchronicity, divine intelligence, cause and effect for somebody's bossing up. It could be a head of um, some sort of authority um, organization that's going to take some going to take control of this situation it's an emperor could be male or female doesn't matter could be a father themselves this is very painful if it has anything to do with young people masquerade oh boy big masquerade big time this is all toxic this is evil this is the devil I've, I've spoken about this before where they use magic to get people to do drugs and alcohol to get them depressed to get them mix up their minds you know what I mean the confusion spells conflict spells Get them to, to leave their homes, to fight with their family and their loved ones, to do the wrong things. Love spells, lust, lust spells, and glamour spells to get them to debase their, their themselves and, and lose their self-respect. And it, it spirals into um, depression, and then eventually they're homeless. You know what I mean? So there's different organizations that are taking money, getting money off a certain person because they get them to sex work uh some sort uh but, you know if they're needing um somebody in, is on a uh, donor's list somewhere if you know what i'm saying they go missing i haven't seen them they were homeless so nobody cares anymore their family's looking for them they don't know what happened to them it's just different things like this if you know what i'm saying and or you know they transport these young people elsewhere it's very toxic ascending so somebody's getting the answers here they're take Transcending obstacles, learning expansion, new phase, preparing for union. You might be somebody that, this union, I don't know what this is, but maybe you're working with somebody on this that is a, a twin or it started off with a twin flame. Maybe you were a twin, you walked away from all this shit, you, 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 you really avoided the, you dodged big time bullets. And you're bringing this out in the open. And unfortunately, maybe your twin was involved with this. And maybe this is your twin that's going to take ownership and, and bring it to an end. Camel boy, small steps, asking for help, 33. So somebody could be an ascendant master. Somebody could, um, making a decision here, number six, the lovers, right? Making a decision, ask for help. Blinded to pain, 13, death. Could be maybe fearing that. They were blinded to this because of the magic, because of what was going on, or maybe they thought they were in too deep. So it's like a lot of self-harming here, You're covering up with drugs and alcohol. They couldn't face what was going on, couldn't face the pain. Girl with a snake, empath and narcissist paradigm, being charmed or used, enable and boundaries. Somebody's going to set some boundaries on this bullshit right now. Angels, let's get an angel card in this. I'm sorry, this is heavy. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. I get the feeling that this person was told, believe, you'll see miracles. This is an intricate web, okay? Spirits all over it. Angels, what's the message here? How are we ending the read for the collective? Ha <sighs> ha, say yeah. Nine of Wands. So somebody's guard is up. They're scared. 51, again, it adds to a six. Decisions, a choice, a contract, higher level of commitment here. Uh, this is a spiritual contract, possibly. 
using your higher wisdom. God, the impenetrable secret. Universal medicine, elevation of the soul, and the revelation of mysteries. Told you. See bottom of the deck. Nine of Pentacles. Wow. Somebody's going to be, yeah, they're they're going rogue rogue on their own. Okay. Iahuia, 33, master number again. Six again. Can't make this up. Six, six, six. Okay. There's sh somebody's shielding you. Okay. Submission to higher order. Identifies traitors and destroys their plans. Wow, I got chills. Temperance, angel. Shawa Kia, 35. Having in integrity, loyalty, and honesty, bravery, and strength. The God of joy. Reconciliation. Regains the favor of those one has offended. Take this leap of faith. Love. Lead with the heart, okay? God, the Redeemer. You're under judgment, okay? Use your intuition. It boils down to a two. That's the high priestess. This was under, This was a secret for so long. Do what's right. Redemption serves against enemies of religion. Governs chastity. Enemies of religion. Okay? Let's get one more. Spirit guides, guardian angels. Ancestors, the white light. How are we ending this read, please? Angels are all over this. Ascended masters are all over this. Obvious 33, right? Where are we going with this? What's, what's the final word on this read, please? Thank you. Chaos and conflict. Can't make it up. 33. Okay. In case you, just, you think I'm full of shit as an intuitive, as a reader. Bottom of the deck, come to the edge, 36. There's going to be enlightenment here, okay? That's the hermit. That's the lovers. Prison, this is prison wear here, the stripes underneath this draft. So everything was hidden underneath a different label, persona. I don't know, maybe it's a, an organization that, well, we help children, we help people. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's all falling apart. Sorry, it's kind of chaotic and scattered all over the place. We started off with a love story that went wrong, and then, but somebody found out some stuff, and this person got involved with this, and, well, here we are, right? 33, chaos and conflict. Essential meanings, disarray, being at cross purposes with another, the tension of opposites, the value of chaos before order. The Oracle's message, opposing forces come together to create a turbulent atmosphere, but consider the value of chaos that serves you well as you become unmoored by it. Scattered to the winds, you leave behind the parts of yourself you no longer need and disperse seeds to reinvent yourself anew. Although the conflict appears to exist externally, its essence is also internal, projected outward and causing disarray. You may find yourself at cross purposes with someone else, facing a storm you feel you can't control. Yet every storm passes and chaos leads to a reordering of things. Conflict. See, order, order. I'm hearing an order. This is an order of some sort. It could be court orders. It could be an order of a, an organization, you know, like a secret society. Conflict provides a way to see more than one side of a situation. Look upon this as just a moment in time when you may need to take shelter and step away from the fray. Don't be too eager to fight. This is a time to understand rather than to be understood. You need to understand the effects of what's going to go, uh, uh, you know, of this. Okay, you need to understand your role in this. You need to understand that somebody needs to step in and take ownership. Okay, come to the edge. Yeah, maybe you're walking on the edge here. You're, you, yeah, but see the hearts. Somebody's leaving some hearts behind. This is love. This is love. Pure, I, I, I'm getting chills again. Maybe you're running out of room here. You're being cornered. You're going to have to do something. 36. I just opened the book and went there. Come to the edge. Courage. Taking a leap of faith. Coming, Overcoming fear and accepting risk. Somebody's got to do it. Right? All the great leaders in the past. Heroes that we talk about in history. They took that risk. And they're forever, ever spoken about. We learn about them in school. They changed the world. They changed um, um, a, a way of thinking. They changed government. They they rebelled. They they did what was right. 
your heroes, right? Facing the unknown is the only choice you really have right now if you want to progress. It's okay to be afraid. Now's the time to take a risk that is not calculated. To feel the exhilaration as you ready yourself for a leap of faith. Spirit is present, so let go of fear. You are called to express your true self. Listen to your heart and soul, not your head. Come to the edge and discover that you can fly. You must step into the unfamiliar so that you may find your miracles. I'm telling you, a miracle shall be done. You will see it with your own eyes and feel it. You will know the divine is here. It's never gone anywhere. They've just taken it out of our homes, our hearts, our minds, our schools, our institutions. It's all business now. You're going to see. People are going to go back to Father. They're going to say, I see it now. I feel it now. He's never gone anywhere. And he's not going anywhere, just so you know. I hope this helps. Please like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, take care.